Jesus really is God's greatest gift. He is a gift, not just for us, but for everyone. And that is part of the reason why God chose to give the message to the shepherds first because he wanted to show us that God's love isn't just for special people or good people, but it is for everyone. And what's also really relatable about the story is when the angels explained to the group of shepherds all that God was doing, they weren't satisfied with just having it explained to them. They had to go and experience it for themselves. Telling you this story is just an explanation. Just like the shepherds, this is something that you guys have to go and experience it for yourselves. Follow the shepherd's example and then you do what they did. Jesus is meant to be experienced and not just explained. The angel is already setting Mary up to know exactly where to go for support. Let us go to To have these two unexpected pregnancies where they were both shouldn't have been able to conceive for different reasons. The angel points Mary to Elizabeth from the jump. Elizabeth is already a common thread in this story. She says that she is favored just by being in Mary's presence and that the baby in Elizabeth's womb leaps for joy. All of these beautiful, celebratory, positive, praiseworthy emotions in a situation that society and potentially Mary herself would have seen differently. Maybe you only see the overwhelm and the dark and the cloudiness of your situation, and it takes an outside perspective to offer that different view. See, Elizabeth didn't see the mess in Mary's situation. She saw the beauty, and she gave Mary the gift of pointing that out to her. 